today I got a Dollar Tree haul because that's my favorite place in the whole wide world apparently. And it is chilly. So where to start? Um, uh, mine didn't really have a lot of Halloween stuff out and I like to decorate my big window I have in my living room. Um, but I did pick up this garland. The little kitty cats on it. I think there's, oh, there's more kitty cats. I'm going to open it. Why not? I have all day. But I just saw the cats in the store, but when I, oh, there's two of them. This is, oh, I bet you this one says Halloween. This one says happy. <laughs> I hate my nose. It's got a little ghost on it. And then, uh oh, tangled. Way beyond the ocean. That's all stuck in my head. And Halloween. -y. So I'm going to put that up in my window when I get a chance. It's still a little bit early. Probably won't do it today. Um, try to think where to go from this. String lights, because everyone knows I'm a whore for string lights. Um, they had three different sets. These aren't Halloween. These ones are little um, rocket ships. I don't know if it's focusing that well. And then stars, like shooting stars. I should have started a garbage pit there. This one's showing up really good. And then Saturn, because I'm a Capricorn. There they are. And then on the space theme, I found this notebook. I really like notebooks with this, um, I don't know, this feel, I guess. But I liked it because it had a little constellations on it. I don't know. I was just feeling space, I guess, that day. Um, novelty socks, because you always have to have your Dollar Tree novelty socks. Little hedgehoggies. You get two pairs. And then, I'll put it this way. Turtle with a birthday hat? <laughs> Miss my little turtle. Choked on a worm died um i found these i thought they'd be good for my pocket letters which i haven't had any out lately but you get two of these in a pack and they only had two sets looks like a candle melted on that one at my store but hell in a store really has been sucking lately i gotta say like really bad but I'm going to open one of these just to show you. I need to go to Bozeman. I just don't, haven't had extra cash to go down there. If I go to Bozeman, I want to spend money. They're kind of thin, but for what I'm going to use them for, it's good. they'll work out fine. So I'll just put those in my thing. Whack yourself in the face. There you go. Um, for wrapping my, like, stuff I send out that's fragile, um, I, instead of bubble wrap, I use their baby blankets. So I just grab some of them real quick. Because before you know it, I'm going to be sending out stuff to family for Christmas and stuff. So I just went ahead and grabbed those. For the kitty cats... <laughs> Always get their treats there. And they're out and they're crying. Um, and they had these catnip toys. I bought two of these because they will pick one and fight over the one instead of just, you know, getting their own. Bye, girls. Um, and then I got some magnets because I have a weird goal of just filling my whole fridge up with magnets. And they're puns. Play well with otters. 
and then cutie pie. This is like pumpkin pie. Take it out of the plastic so it doesn't glare so much. Cutie pie. And then some washi tape. It must have been in a hedgehog mood too because it's got hedgehogs on it. Hedgehog washi tape. I got so much washi tape, but I'm kind of addicted to that too. I'm going to try this. I don't know how good their paint is. I mean, it's the Dollar Tree. <laughs> but I'm just going to use it for mixing. So hopefully that works for mixing. Um, Dollar Tree Band-Aids for my own weird reasons. Um, I found this Triceratops um, what do you call it? Trinket tray? I just thought it was cool. Um, it'll go in my bedroom somewhere, I'm sure. So this is kind of my mean thing to do. <laughs> Here. It's kind of a joke of the store. And I was going to do a loopy, Lupe from my 600 pound life uh, makeup tutorial because she's a style icon. And you can tell she just uses the cheapest stuff she can find. So I went and just went ahead and bought Dollar Tree makeup. I would never buy Dollar Tree makeup ever. But I'm going to do this just for my personal Facebook here. So we got the LA Colors eyeshadow palette. I have seen her wear some like awful purple um, eyeshadow. Like really bad eyeshadow. So hopefully this is it. If not, I'll make it work. <laughs> Security, we got some tape there. It's called Water Lily. I'd be really shocked if there's any color payout on this. Ooh, every beauty guru's favorite here. Ooh, might be. Ugh. That's gonna work. <laughs> and is she all these? Lines her lips with like lip color that's too dark for the lipstick or gouache she is wearing. This is actually e.l.f. I was kind of surprised. I don't like e.l.f. that much, but I know that costs more than a dollar, I believe. It's mauve. So I was going to line my lips with that. That actually is not bad. I'll I'll actually get used from that, I betcha. Because I use a lot of mauve lipstick. And then I found her gloss to clash with her lip liner. That's gonna be stuck in my head on it. Bright, 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 bright pink. Oh yeah, that's gonna be Instagram worthy. I didn't expect that to be a little more uh, translucent. But we're Lupe, it don't matter. And she always has horrible, horrible eyeliner. So I found this, I think it's blue. <laughs> yeah, blue Hawaiian. Jesse's girl, I met him once. Where can I find a woman like that? Really do not want you to get the Jessie girl out. <sighs> Jeez. Okay. Go ahead and do some surgery here. Do a little, uh, what is it called when they slice the baby? Like your butthole, clown your butthole to get the baby out. <laughs> oh, yeah, that is Lupe. <laughs> That'd be great. And then I think this is actually Drew Barrymore's brand flower. I was actually kind of just um, curious about it because it looks like um, old school rouge where you like pinch it and put it on. But Lupe always has the blush, so we're gonna. Oh. 
Drew Barrymore doesn't want you to steal her stuff either. I need my knife. I'm going to slice my fingers off one day. Like that. That's bright. She always has bright. Ooh, this is creamy. It's right there. This is, so that is very old school, but that's probably, I wonder if she was inspired by her like um, old Hollywood family with that. Because somebody asked Drew Barrymore. And the last thing I found this, it's not my color, but once again, we are Lupe and nothing matches. Natural beige. I'm a light beige. So we'll see how this goes. I'm kind of curious what a cushion foundation was like anyhow. Wet and wow. She should be the ambassador for that, by the way. Kind of got cute packaging. We'll give it that. Ooh, that is way dark. Ooh, yeah. High class. How does this open? Does it open from the bottom? <gasps> this is too complicated for me. Oh, there we go. Please remove protective film. Whoa, 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 that's weird. What? Oh, that feels so weird. It's like a, it comes right off. That's weird. <laughs> oh, yeah, that totally matches my skin shade. I don't think this is going to do much good. <laughs> There's a mirror there. Yeah, so that's going to be interesting. So once I wash my face off, I'm going to do that. <laughs> I put fun out of my girl Lupe. Um, so that's everything I got from my Dollar Tree. Um, once again, they, they're kind of like really slacking up there. I don't know what's going on. Um, but yeah, I do have some Ipsito box still and... Uh, bobcat in a box. I don't know if I'm going to do them today. i just not feeling it really. But anyhow, you all have a good day. And I'll see you all later. Have a good day.